Yo, what's going on good people, Cowboys fans, and of course friends of the channel. It's your boy Foots here. And I gotta admit, Sunday, Monday, even today, Tuesday, it's been kind of rough. The Eagles really won a chip. Gotta tip my cap. I don't have a cap, but gotta respect it. And you know, I went on my rant yesterday, uh, Monday morning, and I'm, I'm past it. Got my energy together. I'm ready to talk back about the draft, ready to get back into some film study. And listen, all we can control, fans, is what we can control. Um, getting aware, thinking of different draft situations, and ultimately how we're going to fix this team and make a run. Um, because I think all the YouTubers who have been talking about it are right. This is Jason's year. Um, I think Jerry watched the Super Bowl saying, I got to get me one. Doug Peterson got him one in two years after coaching high school football nine years ago. So I won't dwell on that, but it's time. So today I'm coming at you guys with a draft breakdown and how he fits with the Cowboys. And you guys know the name. It's Rashawn Evans. Um, and initially, when I first did these linebackers and when I first got into my, my, my real draft study and my, real, my, my scouting reports on all these guys and started watching film, I was very high on Tremaine Edmonds, and, Edmonds, and I still am. Um, he was actually my pet cat, and now draft community is caught up. But you guys know, and you guys can go back to the videos, he was actually one of the first scouting breakdowns that I did, and now everybody has him as their linebacker one. And initially, I went into it kind of not giving Rashawn Evans a fair square or a fair shot, simply because He's playing around a bunch of studs at Alabama, you know, Mika, Mika Fitzpatrick, uh, Ronnie Harrison, Deron Payne, the list goes on. Um, so with those Alabama players, you have to be careful. But, man, was I wrong. And it wasn't that I was so, so, so much of wrong. It was more what was I looking for? What was I looking at him do? Uh, what was I looking at him to do? And I really was pleasantly surprised when I went back with a fresh mind and, um, and really – Gave a good, solid scouting breakdown to Rashawn Evans. I hope you guys enjoy. So, Rashawn Evans, a senior. I have a first-round grade on him. And the games I watched were LSU and Florida State and a bunch of his highlights. Listen, he's a really good blitzer. He uses his hands very, very well. When the ball doesn't come to his side, he still stays engaged. He's always involved in the game. Almost always runs under control and knows how to gather and stay composed. That's very important. Um, and he also knows how to bring himself to a good stop when he makes tackles. When he hits you, the ball carrier stops, period. He brings attitude the way he plays. Um, he brings an attitude to a defense as well. Um, he was a leader of that Alabama defense. I haven't seen a lot of him in coverage, so that's kind of my only question. But, hey, I do, I do think that he moves very, very well. He just wasn't asked to do that a lot at Alabama. They have a lot of studs. Um, he takes on linemen very well. That's one of his biggest, biggest attributes. He takes on linemen very, very well. Um, listen, he moves through clutter very well. And with this team, with the Dallas Cowboys, I think he would be a, a great middle linebacker or a strong, a strong side backer. Think of him as an upgraded version of Anthony Hitchens. And my player comp for him is Navarro Bowman. Let's get into his film. So here we go against LSU right off the breaks. Look how he stands up the tight end right here. Boom! It's like... That was amazing. I had to run it back. Look at this, you guys. Watch 84 just stand completely up. That's Rashawn Evans. Nice to meet you. He has that type of fierceness about him. Now, this is one of my favorite plays. They try to do a little, it was a little shovel pitch type deal. And Rashawn Evans isn't fooled. He's a very smart player, always where he's supposed to be. And obviously, he just brought the boom. Ooh, you feel bad for that tight end. Now, look at him. Just hype. And you can see right here, try to do some type of misdirection. Wasn't fooled at all. A very sound player. Now, here's another one of my favorite plays from Evans. This is what I mean by composed. Doesn't run out of control, is able to gather himself and make a sure tackle. You need that in the league now. You need guys making good tackles. And my favorite pay, play, look how he just destroys Geis right there. That's a first round pick at running back. Fights through the clutter, gets around the guard, boom! I believe that's, I believe that's a tackle. But nonetheless, he gets around the offensive lineman who tries to get on him and he just destroyed Geis. 
Listen, I think this guy will fit in very well in Dallas' scheme. Will bring that attitude, free up Sean Lee, free up Jalen to go get the ball, and he will control everything in the middle. It's your boy, Fusta King. Thank you guys for watching, liking, sharing, and let's get the numbers up. Let's donate. Please, guys, it means the world to me. Trying to make some upgrades to this channel. New camera, want to go live, want to do all those cool things. So if you guys can, please hit the link in the description box. It's the GoFundMe. We're at 255. We're trying to get to 1,000 so I can do some cool things in this room. It's your boy, Fusta King. Thank you, guys. More draft breakdowns coming soon. Peace.